you ever run an automated cold email campaign before, you look at your result and you probably saw that getting one interesting reply out of 100 emails sent is actually normal. Most people think that's what they should be getting, but the reality is that getting one interest reply out of hundreds of emails sent is way lower than what's possible. All because they simply don't have enough information to send email that can get any higher reply rates. So what if I told you there's a way to send a thousand different automated cold email per day and get 10, 20, even 30 interest reply totally automated at scale and without any manual effort. I live and breathe go-to-market system and outbound sales and I've coached dozens of people to actually ramp up their lead generation agency and I probably generated tens of millions of dollars combined from my clients or outbound and cold email. And in this video, I'll be showing you how to use the most sophisticated cold email software ever so that you can send thousands of cold emails per day at total scale in a hyper relevant and personalized way. If you watch this video through the end, I can guarantee you that you will completely beat your competition, sell more deals and never sales salespeople to be able to handle all the business that you will be able to get. So let me just show you how some cold email results actually looks like. In the old way of actually sending cold emails, you would probably use a provider like Apollo or any other scraper and some realistic results are right now are probably this let's say you want to send a thousand cold emails per day which is more or less 30,000 cold email per month and assuming an interested reply of 0.5 percent you will get more or less 150 interested reply positive replies so according to a 30 percent interest to meeting ratio you would probably have 45 demos 45 meetings things to actually do and let's stay conservative it's a cold traffic so you would probably have like 20 percent if you're lucky of uh, actually conversion rate you can probably close nine deals and from nine deals assuming a deal size of ten thousand dollars you would probably generate ninety thousand dollars this is more or less how much you would gain if you actually nail down cold email and you really can make everything more efficient the problem is uh, if you use this kind of software called the clay and you really have all the information to send emails and uh, first of all you can create superior lists and you have a way faster way to actually test messages at scale so you can nail down the right value proposition faster and you can send the hyper personalized emails i really think you can make even 5x to 10x better results and in terms of revenue generated you will see completely change everything and i'm not joking when i say 5 to 10x because uh, let's say we are selling to e-commerce manager and you just use Apollo, you get all the e-commerce manager list, you check manually what is the list looks like. You will notice that most of them are not even e-commerces because for example, some agency owners could uh, probably have job title or something like e-commerce manager, even if they are not really e-commerce owner, but just helping e-commerces. With Clay, you can make such a better listing in seconds so that you're not lazy and you can actually create a superior outreach with better personalized messaging. You can really Really get to 5 to 10x better and with 5 to 10x better results more or less looks like this so of course number of personalized email per day you can really choose because you can even send more right now because it's more personalized and the number of even per month 30k interested replies would be something like 2.5 percent so every under email you send you can really get one two even three interested replies if you're very good at it this means that you will get 750 positive replies assuming Assuming again 30% uh, booking conversion rate of 225 meetings, 45 uh, deal closed. Again, same deal size, you will get 450k, which is totally different, of course, than a 90k in result. This is how Clay is powerful and why you should really consider it because it can totally change and skyrocket your results and the ROI of your outbound project. These results, of course, uh, can seem exciting and not only me, but many of the clients and the B2B professionals and coaching are getting the same result. So let me give you a step-by-step -step guide to actually set up everything to start extending like this in terms of addresses and domains. So first of all, uh, if you want to send a thousand emails per day, let's try to do the math together. And to stay safe, you really just uh, can send 10 to 20 emails per address per day, let's say conservative, and let's say 10 emails per address per day, which means uh, you need to buy 50 domains. And from those 50 domains, up two addresses so that you get the under addresses. In terms
terms of addresses, uh, what I really suggest is diversify. Diversify your email infrastructure because we don't really know what's going to work. But if we stay diversified, we can actually win this game and scale up our campaigns. So divide in three, like 30%, Google 30%, Outlook, and the rest in private servers. For Outlook and Google, there are some services such as Instantly or Sellers where you can actually buy the domains and it will set up all the DNS and all the deliverability rules to actually stay outside the spam and really send safely while private servers is a bit the news in the cold email game so there are providers with private servers to actually host your addresses and it's a bet but most of them are actually good I think you should try Inframail or MailScale or other services like these because they are very cheap very easy to set up and if you get trouble you can just set up new domains so in this way we can say that you have to spend like $500 for the domains because it would be something like $10 per domain you need 50 domains so $500 and then something like 300 per month for all the addresses if you think it's a lot check again the possible results that we can get and make your own math how much you would spend with normal SDRs or advertising you would spend 10x more and under tax more you are lucky you can actually love a cold email you have to do your own work you have to actually master the skill you have to be really good in tools like clay.com but then the ROI totally makes sense for you and for your clients another thing that I recommend is start sending slowly so don't start with 10 or 20 per day just start with one two three and just ramp up the numbers accordingly and secondly wait 15 days of warming up through instantly or smart lead not to land in spam and in those 15 days maybe hire an inbox manager because of course if you have a market if you have a team that is like 30,000 leads 30,000 companies totally hire one because you will get your inbox flooded with replies interested replies hand raise you really want to manage them accordingly to actually drive some revenue okay this is clay and is basically the biggest the most efficient prospecting machine ever is like a sales ops uh, engine where you can create lists and get data from everywhere on the internet like find companies find open jobs find the commerce scrape google maps import from apps both from other crm from close from a google search from salesforce phantom buster is like the ultimate tool to actually master your own outreach game and really create an organization that can scale to the moon thanks to this incredible technology and let's say i want to find people i want e-commerce managers we were talking about e-commerce or so let's stay relevant e-commerce in location united states preview people and let's get uh, all the leads import import a new table continue for free and magically we got all the list and here starts the really difference between clay and any other prospecting tool because clay is not a prospecting tool it's not a data provider it's like the main sales operation engine where you have connecting all the data provider in the world all the enrichment in the world all the apis in the world for example let's say i want more information on these leads and you're not probably get a lot of results because think about it you just have a list but to stay relevant to create personalized messages at scale you need more information you don't know anything about these guys you don't know anything about their e-commerce are they b2c are they b2b they have a good seo they have a paid that strategy you don't know anything if you start from a very generic uh, data provider but in this way you can get any information at scale and you can get incredible outreach with impossible results otherwise for example let's say that from these guys uh, from their e-commerce I want to get uh, the website traffic because maybe I'm selling a CRO offer and I only want to prospect e-commerce with such a huge website traffic so my offer makes sense cool I can simply go to SEMrush, Great African Analytics. You can see I can put the input, I can put the country, save, run the rows, and magically at scale through the SEMrush API, I can get all the results. Clicking on the results, you can see mobile visits, paid visit, direct visit, search visit. For example, I know that this e commerce has a lot of traffic. This is incredible SEO traffic. And maybe this time I want to get the bounce rate because maybe they have a retention problem. In 
terms of traffic. And I have this data too. But what traffic, just an example, I can have so many things. For example, I can connect in a moment built with, and I can get really at scale. For example, what uh, email platform they're using. Maybe they're using Klaviyo, maybe they're using MailChimp. It's enough to say email platform or email marketing or even just email. The domain as the input, all return, exact technology names, no, use description, yes, continue to a field, save, run 10 rows, and again, at scale, we can get all the technology and these e-commerce is using. Cool, let's click on it. Mailman, Shopify, email marketing, Google Apps, business. Let's check this other, and of course, he's using MailChimp, Alfred 60. And again, it could be an amazing prospecting angle because maybe e-commerce are using MailChimp have uh, deliverability problems, so you can reach out, actually create a very personalized message and mention, hey, if you're having MailChimp, you can probably have deliverability problem, but you can mention this problem at scale. So in this way, Clay actually become a tool to scrape problem at scale and create hyper relevant messages for your target audience. So now we know how Clay works and it's time to actually see in practice if you have to really build a list from scratch, how it works, how to get the leads, how to get the people, how to get all the personal data, such as the emails, the LinkedIn, the phone numbers, and how to create a relevant copy at scale, leveraging scrape and AI personalization to create messages so great at scale, you wouldn't believe possible. For example, let's say we want to do the same with the Sales Navigator or Apollo. Of course, it's totally different. First of all, e-commerce, especially small e-commerce, are not really into LinkedIn or Apollo because think about it, they are B2C brands. They have zero incentive to be listed on a B2B platform. So even if you go to Sales Navigator, you look for accounts, you try to search something and you say something like e-commerce, man, there are not a lot of e-commerces. And first of all, it's very difficult to categorize them because, uh, yeah, maybe there are agencies saying, I help e-commerces. And e-commerce doesn't call himself e-commerce on LinkedIn or Apollo. There's not the category e-commerce. It's very difficult to get them at scale. And even if you can get them, it's not easy to actually bring all this data from here to outside to actually sending emails. We will need to master Google Sheet. Uh, then we have to export send to smart lead acceptor acceptor while if we go to clay and we really want to map all the list of all e-commerces in the united states in italy in spain or wherever it's very easy guys because create new table it's enough to go to store leads and store leads is an amazing database you can do continue you can query whatever e-commerce platform that you actually want technologies category features country we can say united states okay number of results let's say a thousand or a hundred but of course if you want to send 30,000 emails per month it would be way more than this and there are ways to actually go over the limits don't worry about that continue create a new table and let's go in really a seconds we will have the full list of all the e-commerces and moreover we have a lot of information for example we have the city where the e-commerce is operating we have the rank we have the keywords keywords are very interesting to actually leverage this data at scale to create relevant campaigns. Then we have uh, categories like home, garden, and furniture. So we even have ideas of what these e-commerces are selling and lots of other information such as estimate sales, financial page, etc, etc. And from here, you can even use uh, other tools such as the one that you've seen before, such as SEMrush or Google News to check like uh, PR articles. You can do a Google search to see if it ranks for some keywords. You can really use different data sources to actually create an amazing outreach strategy and measure relevant information at scale. Now from the URLs, we want to find the people and to find the people, we can use tools such as Apollo API, but Apollo API on clay so that the outreach would be amazing and way faster. Find people at company, job title, we can say e-commerce manager or owner or a mark marketing executive domains uh, we have to put uh, the domain as an input uh, continue to add field save save around the rows and magically we will get uh, all the personal information of the people running these e-commerce as you can see we can have all the information such as the name the email we have the title such as marketing manager where the marketing manager is actually living and a lot of different information from these people because 
because most of the time the email is blocked from uh, Apollo, it's enough to find the email and we have an amazing waterfall of emails and through this waterfall we can use different providers to maximize our ability to get uh, emails, not just using one provider such as Apollo or uh, find email, but in this way we can leverage all of them and get the best result possible. Input, find name, we can even validate the email. I recommend to really validate the email if you want to send in a safe way, save rent and rows, and in this way all the providers will work together to actually get our contact information. And remember, if I'm not mentioning some use cases, it's not said that they are not into Clay. In Clay we have everything. Everything that you have on the web is scrapable through Clay, and you can leverage it at your advantage to create a personalized message. Whatever comes to your mind, for example, let's say free shipping. We are offering a solution to actually make uh, the shipping cheaper so that e-commerces can actually offer free shipping and drastically increase the number of possible sales. Very easy, you just have to think uh, what is the best piece of data on the internet that can suggest me if an e-commerce with a prospect actually has this problem. In this case, uh, would be Clay Agent. I'm very expert in this so I can get it very easily, but you just need a little bit of practice to actually understand what is the right data point to get the right problem at scale. And this way you would have all the information necessary to create the best outreach message ever. So in this case, it would be very easy because it's enough to say, okay, go to the main and try to check if the e-commerce is offering free shipping or not. Just return yes or no and nothing else. Save round and rows and we can get all this information in really seconds so that we can create an amazing outreach strategy. And as you can see, this is going to literally change everything in terms of copy because instead of saying a hey, name, I notice your company is very similar to the case study that I have. You can really be relevant at scale, putting all the different variables that we had scraped before to create a message that would be important possible to create otherwise. Now that uh, we have all the leads, uh, we can send all of them inside our sending tools and start sending cold emails and super personalized messages to actually outreach your our own market. And uh, let's see how this works into Clay. It's enough to go to other enrichment. Now we have to write the name of your favorite sending tool, can be smart lead, instantly and whatever else it is connected to Clay. I really like smart lead, so let's just type add lead to campaign. Add lead com to campaign, you have to choose use your own account to actually sending emails from your own account, the campaign ID. So you have to first create your own campaign with a copy and then you have to select the campaign email address. You can find the email and put the email directly. And as you can see with the backslash, you can actually call all the inputs, first name and then last name, phone number, website. And in particular in this uh, section, which is called custom fields, you can really add any kind of variables you think that are relevant. And you want to use later your own copy. So for example, SEO score. Let's say that first you scrape the SEO score and in particular how much it takes for a web page to load. So at scale you can say, hey, I noticed that your website loads in five seconds. What if we can decrease that number from five seconds to three seconds so you get more conversion, more money, and it actually makes sense for your own commerce. We can do this at scale. We just need to find the right data, scrape the right uh, variable, and put it into smart lead. Can be SEO, can be the name of the marketing manager, can be the website traffic, can be the how much a company is spending. It's really a game of understanding where the data is and use Clay to get it and send it to the sending provider so you can leverage the data at scale. Then it's enough to click save and it will go through all the list to get all the data and outreach your own market in a super relevant and personalized way. So now this campaign is ready to go. You just just have to wait 14 days and really start outreaching your own market. But just to remind you, this strategy work very well, of course, even with a small number of emails, if you want to buy less accounts. But if you really want to take full advantage of this technology, you have to send a high volume of emails because you can be really relevant at scale. And at the end of the day, output is really a number game. So if you really want to hit your quota numbers, just buy the addresses, connect everything to Clay, put the effort to master the tool so that you can really crush your own numbers.
course. So if you want to get access to my clay scaler annual, get the information to scan clay without credits, get 3000 free clay credits, and actually understand how to drive incredible results to clients, go to the description and check it out. Also, click on this video here if you want to access my clay.com course for free and get the basic information to actually scale clay. Thank you so much and see you in the next one.